um, question number 18. So let's see. We have to find the equation of the tangent line at the point indicated. Um, so this is the equation of the graph that they give us. So y equals e to the x squared. And then at the point indicated, they give us x naught equals 1. So for a tangent line, um, let's say the graph somehow, I don't know, let's just get an idea of what it looks like. So let's say it looks like this or something. It's probably more steep, but, you know, the drawing is not to scale. But um, so at x naught equals 1. So this is what they gave us. So at this point right here, they want to know what the tangent line looks like. So line tangent to the curve. Okay, so for this we have to know um, why, what the actual value is, y value is, and we need to know, so this is like our um, y naught. <laughs> that's funny, y naught. But um, So this is, one is our x naught, and that's our y naught, and then we also have to know the slope of the tangent line, which would be the first derivative evaluated at this point. So first of all, y naught would be um, e to the x naught 2. If you plug in 1, this would be e to the 1 to the second uh, 2, which just equals e. Okay, so we have that, and now we need the slope at that point. So like I said, that would be our first derivative, so y prime equals e to the x squared times chain rule, so 2x. And then at this point, so y at 1, because we want to know the slope exactly at this point, this would equal e to the 1 squared times 2 times 1, which simply equals 2e. Okay, so this is our slope. This is like m, right, at that point. And then this is our y value. And this is our x value. Okay, so if we put it all together, then we'll get y equals, um, I'll just write out the general formula. So m times, what's an m? x minus x naught plus y naught. So our final equation of the tangent line at this point is going to be uh, 2e that we plug in for m, and then x minus x naught, which is 1 and then plus whatever we got for y, which is e. Okay, and this is our final answer. All right, that, that does it for question number eight.